Now I've put the two pieces together. As you can see, they're both done right, and I'm kind of happy with that. So the very next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put the middle sections together. Again, I'm going to pay attention to those quarter-inch marks that I've put on my on all of my uh, pieces. So I'm going to line them up. Find that quarter inch there, and my quarter inch here, and, and this part is very important because this is the center star, so you want to make sure that you get that as perfect as you can. You know, I've never, uh, I've always been kind of a sloppy quilter. And I must say, since I started doing smaller or miniature uh, thing uh, quilts, I've gotten so much more precise. Um, and it's really not that hard. Um, I would suggest that you always square up your blocks. It's really important. Um, I have a much better look now to my quilts because I started doing that. You who have always done it, I, that's really great. But I can tell you, I have not. All right, so we're going to lock that. And I think I'm going to put that on fairly slow. And be very careful how I get through this. And again, I want to stop right at that mark. So I'm going to need to go very slow and I'm not going to go over my pin, but right uh, next to it. And this is a little harder to go have a pin with this foot, but I love that quarter inch foot. So see if that the most important thing here is this center square. And that's good. All right. So now we'll do the end. You have to manipulate this a little bit to get those edges together. out again to the eighth block or not blocks braid put these in there to slow down my machine a little bit and manipulate the fabric so I make sure that I get that right to the edge there. that stitch and it'll lay down perfectly. 
I won't have to tear it out, just have to take out one little stitch there and it'll work. <coughs> so I'm almost there. I only have one side left. And again, can manipulate that piece so that it, it all finds its way to the right place. start sewing right there and I want to stop right here watching me sew is like watching molasses huh. there we go I feel like the sloth sewing this slow, but I'll get a much better product out of it if I do, if I slow down. Okay. So again, I want it to start at exactly the right spot. Looks like I've got it first time. So we'll put that down. we forget we're on camera so again oh that looks good I'm happy I'm going to go press that and then um, I will start making my borders <laughs> 